Hello and welcome everyone, I'm Amethyst Runewitch and today I'm going to be unboxing the March Witch Casket. So this is the March one, I believe this one's all about, um, what is it, it's craft. So things to make, things that you can create. Um, I've seen the little trailer, I'm not entirely sure what's going to be in this, but this is the short end. Um, this box is not closing fully. I swear I have not looked inside. All I've done is taken it out of this. So this is the bag that the casket comes in. Um, it's as they say it is on their website it is very discreet the only way you know that it's from witch casket is when you get the box out anyway let's get into this oh crikey it is very very full so yes it's all about witch craft all the crafty bits so let's have a look see at everything so this is the information pamphlet, so the front cover, and there's always um, having to rearrange because a certain small furball of mine wants to uh, come and say hello and investigate. And you're just going to curl up and be cute. So yes, that's the front cover. There is, if you want to submit any photos that you've got, that you've taken of um, the item that you've received, then they will credit, you know, they'll share and credit. Um, but Sorry, I'm having to watch the cat and try and do this all at once. Anyway, so on the inside of the pamphlet, so immediately behind the front cover, there is always an extra piece of artwork. And that looks amazing. And then the message, monthly message. Hello, our magical family of witches. Your March casket puts the craft into witchcraft and we hope it motivates you all to weave magic and artistry into everything that you do. Please read through this pamphlet so you can familiarise yourself with the contents and any safety information. We are, as always, busy preparing next month's casket and we have so many wonderful magical plans for future months. In the meantime, if you have any questions or comments, please feel free to email us with your feedback. We'd love to hear from you. Also, please be sure to tag any social media posts so we can easily find and share them. Each time we're tagged in one of your bewitching and beautiful posts, we can't tell you the appreciation and love we feel. You all are so special and important to us, and it means the world to us to know you are happy with what we do. Sending all our love and positive energy to you all. Until the next time, be well, Deb and Ella. And then following that, it's spoilers. So I prefer to leave this um, to one side until the very end to attempt to repack everything. All I will do is I will move things because I can tell there's so much in this casket. All I'm going to do today is move things from one side of me to the other. Um, so I know what's, what's what. So let's get into it. First off is artwork. Oh, I love this. Rabbit artwork. So 
rabbit artwork looks amazing. I love all the little bits and bobs. It's candle, mushrooms, butterflies, crystals. Oh, and on the back, there's monthly manifestations. This is a new one. This is, I don't use them, but they're an option. I prefer just the artwork, but that's, that's just me. This month, we seem to have a flat scroll. So this would usually be a scroll, so it would be rolled up. But I think to save um, some space, it's been flattened, which is absolutely fine. I don't mind. It'll make going in my grimoire a little bit easier. That's the sticker. I'm going to have a look at this now because then it's done. Can I get this off as easily as I do? As easily as I usually do with the scrolls. So this scroll, this parchment, is all about putting the craft in witchcraft and some simple and crafty ways to do it. Amazing. That's definitely going in my, uh, in the folder with the rest of these. So that's that. Next we have parchment spell sheets. I don't know what this is. Right. It's going to be one of those I have to ruin the envelope to get into it. Indeed. Seems that way. These are pretty. So there's four sheets. Yep, just the four. And they are blank pieces of paper with designs on them. They are really pretty. I probably, I personally probably won't use them as spell sheets, um, but I can at least write letters, magical letters on them. So there's that. Next we have an ephemera collection. These enchanting paper craft items have been designed by us, especially for you to use for scrapbooking, journaling or to add extra creativity to your book of shadows oh, this is easier to open that's better oh right have i lost everything yes so seems the paper um things that you can stick in. I like that one. I do like this one. Little label. Oh. No. Plant. Hold up. Star, compass star, another label of sorts. Oh, 
this reminds me of the stitch kit, the stitching kit, um, the embroidery kit that Witch Casket sent in a previous casket. I do love the cauldron. I love a good cauldron. Then Shroom in the Moon. And then more, pa more papers, but these are different designs. plants on there and moss bat moon and stars interesting pop those in first so that's the ephemera collection Next, we have, <laughs> we've got a stitching kit. It's an intentions cross stitch kit. It contains everything you need to create a beautiful embroidered work of art. As I will it, so mote it be. Display the intention, uh, the power of your magic. Work your intentions into every stitch. Now, this is quite a very, this is quite a packed package. So, the gluing has come undone, but that's okay, because I probably won't take very long to do this. I am an avid cross-stitcher. I've, I've been a cross-stitcher since I was in my very early teens. I'm not going to say how long ago that was, but we've got a black satin covered... I want to say satin it could be something else but it's a black something black fabric color covered hoop embroidery hoop five different colors sort of brown grays and greens Black Ada, which is the cross stitching fabric, and then oh, that's what it'll look like. We've got the design now. I wonder if the needle has come out because it's not in the kit, it's usually a needle, so it does come with instructions on how to do cross stitch comes with the chart and what it should look like at the end. And then it's got the key for the chart as well with the different threads. Now do they have numbers? They don't. I will probably, hopefully, be able to tell you which one's which. We shall see. We'll find out. We'll find out. So that's the cross stitch kit. So let's see. Can we get some smaller bits? Oh, we have a positive energy charm bag. I wonder if that's today's kit. Well, spell kit. It's always a spell kit. This one does not come in its usual black paper um, bag, envelope thing. So we've got a pouch, we've got, what is this? This is rose quartz chips. Then there's lavender and dried orange peel as the herbs it does come with instructions and there's even more artwork on the back so that's a spell kit oh what's this 
got another one an all-purpose not magic spell and it comes with charms it's got ribbon string instructions and more artwork on the back of them so let's have a look what are the charms so we've got a key or a hoop so there's a little key we have a pentacle lovely pentacle and then we have a heart lovely heart it says there's four knots tying a charm into each knot oh i like that and then the artwork on the back that's quite a pretty thing I might do this as part of a, a thing so that's two spell kits we've had so far lovely right we have crystal blue appetites let's see so blue appetite shields against muddled thinking apathy and negativity it enhances creativity communication and is a great study aid blue appetite opens the mind to receive knowledge and enhances psychic powers so there's that's what I've just read and then you've got a little woodland pentacle and the piece of appetite itself quite a decent size chunk so put that back in Pin. Oh, it's always a pin. It's always a pin. And this one is a potion bottle. The plant with herbs, crystals. Scroll in the neck of it. Quite a pretty pin. Now, what's this? witchy washi tape now how do i get into this aha uh -huh. there we go ah oh, there's three different types so this one is as I will it, so mote it be. Interesting. Then we have the design from the lanyard that they've sent previously. And then acorn, spell bottle, key, cauldron. There's all sorts on this one. Hmm. So that's the three different tapes. I will hopefully find a use for those. Comes in a lovely little box. Use this enchanting tape for paper craft projects such as scrapbooking, journaling, or to add extra creativity to your book of shadows. And on the top of it. Hmm, interesting. Right, got a stamp set. 
Stamps are a perfect way to imprint your intention into written spells or add beauty to your book of shadows. Okay, let's have a look see. Oh, it comes with ink as well. So there's a an ink and then the three stamps. As I will it, so mote it be. Now I should probably show the other side. The other side is literally the reverse of what this side is. So as this looks, that's how it will be stamped. And then of course, pentacle. And then we've got crescent moon and some stars Ooh. that's quite pretty i like that and then big box <gasps> So this top does not give anything away. <laughs> However, the cup and saucer. If you've been watching along, I am a massive tea drinker. I love my teas. I have a collection of mugs, huge collection of mugs. My tea collection is even bigger. I have 70 different brews and blends. Of course, the image on the side gives it away. But this is Enchanting Teaware for your witch's brew. Stir with intent and drink mindfully. Now, let's see the design of this. Oh, no way. Oh, oh my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> so, the outer does not give anything away this this is not the inside the inside has all different images lovely little teacup so that's obviously the teacup and underneath is the saucer which mirrors the inside of the cup with the design. Look. Oh, that looks amazing. <laughs> oh, that's gorgeous. Oh, that's perfect. Oh, I can't wait to use that now. Oh, amazing. So, let's Oh, that's everything. Casket box is empty. It's officially empty. I left the big box till last. I'm very glad I did. Just because it's, it's a cup and saucer. Cup and saucer. So, let's go through the spoilers. Well, they're not spoilers now anymore. So, we have a charming cup and saucer. Chanting tea wear for your witch's brew. Clockwise to attract. Anti-clockwise to banish. Then we have the intentions cross stitch. I'm in the middle of a project at the moment, but I promise as soon as that is done. No, you're not jumping up. I found 
found I found needles. They haven't fallen out. They're in with one of the one of the colours. They're in with one of the colours. Oh. Not that I need any more needles. I have plenty of those already. Now then let's see. Can we get this back in? It's in the pockets coming undone. It's 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 done for. That's okay. It's it's gonna go somewhere really safe. Just gonna pop that there. Then we've got the witchy washi tape. Let's do this one. We have the ephemera collection. So all the different papery bits. These bewitching paper craft items. Oh, bewitching rather than enchanting. Yeah. Then we have the not magic spell. So we've got that kit. We've got the magical stamping set. This lovely. Hold on. Just say if I pull it this way. Three stamps and some ink. parchment spell sheets this lovely envelope we've got the positive energy charm bag kit which i'm not going to put back in the bag because it was rather well stuffed in i'm gonna put, I'm gonna put it in the bag hopefully just not as it was not you we went in there. I'm not going to tie it because that's just asking for trouble, in my opinion. It's Blue Appetite Crystal. We've got the Magical Charm Bottle Enamel Pin. That would be this one. that was the pin we've got the putting the craft in witchcraft parchment scroll although less a scroll and more flat but that's okay with how little space there is in this casket it's unreal i would not expect that to be a scroll and then we've got the magical hair art print Ooh. That's everything. I can't quite remember what the theme is for the April casket. Now, the March casket was sent off a little bit delayed, um, usually shipped between the 14th and the 17th of every month. Um, March was shipped, I believe, it was Wednesday. 27th now which casket are offering 
um, as standard now with their shipping it's all tracked so we get the shipping email from which casket and then there's another email that follows from our standard our normal um, postal delivery service which for me I'm in the UK it's the Royal Mail and I got an email saying this is going to be delivered um, on this date between these times which is great I'm not sure how it is in other countries but that's certainly how it is in the UK um, so it was nice to get the emails and which casket were updating all along the way um, which was really really nice and yeah if you'd like to receive a casket of your own in the future um, if you subscribe before the 14th so from um, when this comes out you've got until the 14th of April to subscribe to receive the April casket after that you'll get the May casket so between the 14th of April and the 14th of May you get the May casket 14th of May to 14th of June you get the June casket so it's it's rolling half monthly but it's lovely brilliant I love these genuinely I've I've loved all everything I've received and this casket is just amazing so April casket is due to be shipped out as normal on the 14th between the 14th and the 17th um, so that should be nice and easy and yeah if you'd like to subscribe I'll put all the details in the description uh, down below so you can check them out and sign up subscribe um, subscribers do get access to subscriber only shop um, which is password protected you get the password when you get your shipping usually with the shipping email um, I believe this month they might have sent the password out early I can't remember it's been a while since I ordered from the uh, shop but that's my own personal situation um, really because there's not an awful lot there that I need because I get all the items anyway um, but yeah no it's great I love it um, if you'd like to receive it yourself check them out they're amazing and yeah I shall see you again soon for more magic and for more unboxings I shall see you again soon stay safe everyone blessings to you all